this video will show how the sample is collected for arterial blood gas analysis from radial artery the blood sample so first we have to wash our hand then we introduce ourselves to the patient then we confirm the patient's details like age, name, sex, address and we explain the procedure nicely to the patient what is to be done and what will be done then we gain consent from the patient and then we check for any contraindications like uh, if he is having any uh, blood coagulation disease or is he taking any anticoagulants like that then we have to we have to find out the contraindications first and it's very important Then we'll prepare the equipment, globes, gauze, local anesthetic, usually lignocaine, including syringe and needle, alcohol wipe, tape, ABG needle. Now first, before taking the sample, we have to do this mo uh, modified lens test to see the, to see whether the blood flow in the hand is normal or not. Cleanse the fist for around 30 seconds. Then apply pressure to the radial and ulnar artery. The left side is ulnar. This is the ulnar side. This is the radial side. Now, when we release the hand, we can see that it is pale. This is called paler. Then we release the ulnar now it has turned to red this rhubarb color so the color returned to the entire hand within 5 to 15 seconds with adequate ulnar blood flow so if there is adequate ulnar blood flow then we can proceed with the this now First, we have to palpate the radial pulse and assess its course. <coughs> then we clean for 30 seconds and allow it to dry with alcohol. Then we don the apron, we wash our hand. Then we will don the gloves. Now we see this. Usually, this uh, ABG needle or syringe comes with preloaded heparin, and we have to expel the heparin outside the needles. Okay. Then insert the needles at 45 degree, and observe the flesh black of blood, and allow it to self fill. And after that, we discard the needle and we cover the syringe and we label the sample. And we thank the patient. Then we wash our hand. Now, this is how we take the sample for ABG, arterial blood gas. Now, we will see the next video will be for like uh, how the how it is put into the machine you know, barcode method now this is uh, this will show how the sample is being put and tested in using the ABG, ABG analyzer
dispose of the previous set of clothes and sanitize hair and apply new clothes. Barcode is used for just uh, this one to get the patient information and it can be done in two two ways the capillary tube way and the syringe way so we'll be doing using the syringe way okay just now we selected the syringe this is how syringe should be done do not inject the blood That barcode is for just apply uh, uh, inputting the patient information. See, after that, the patient will automatically analyze the parameters and print it out. Now, this is the ABG report, pH, PCO2, PO2, and all this saturation will be written there. Now, this is the manual method. Let's see the manual method when the patient details are not known. Same as before only. A small amount of blood is discarded. Then we use the syringe choose the syringe method Patient ID, like you have to manually enter the patient information and the ID, you know, in this case. So, same as before.